You stink. You motherfucker. I'm fucking invincible. This one, hero. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Rio, I hope it didn't destroy the <laughs> I'm right behind you. <laughs> See you later, hero. <laughs> I hope my computer's okay. Computer, you're all right. Hi, Junior Ranger Zari. Hi, Leo. There's an animal stuck in the middle of the road, and cars are moving by really fast. It looks like some type of scaly reptile. I need your help to save it. We'll be right over, Zari. Please, hurry. Ranger out. Ranger out. We have to go right now. We can find out more information about the animal on the way there. Roger that, Leo. See you downstairs. Ranger Leo all set. Woohoo! <laughs> Junior Rangers to the rescue! Platypus One, activate! Here, Here we, go. we go! Don't worry, I'm here! And I won't take my eyes off you! Hello? Oh, yes, Mommy! Got it, Mommy. <gasps> oh, no! Where did it go? What did you find out about the reptile, Katie? It's not a reptile, Leo. The animal Zari found is a Sunda pangolin. It's a mammal, and one of the few known to be covered in scales from head to toe. Pangolins are nocturnal, shy, and solitary. A shy mammal with scales? Cool! <laughs> Hi, Zari. Hi, Zari. The animal on the road is a Sunda pangolin. Yeah, about that. I, um, lost it. Oh, no. It must be around here somewhere. Let's spread out and search. Jetpack activate. activate. Time to roll. Where are you, pangolin? Great idea, hero. Now let's see if we can spot the pangolin. <gasps> there it is! I see it! <gasps> the pangolin turned into a ball? We need to get it off the road quick! I can dash out and pick it up! No! It's too dangerous, Zari. I've got another idea. I'll swoop down and grab the pangolin. Katie, Zari, tell me when there are no cars. Be careful, Leo. I'm ready. Wait for it. Wait. And now. I'm coming for you, Pangolin. No, Leo. A car is coming. Fly back up. Ah. Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky. You're safe now, Leo. Thanks, Ranger Rocky. But the Pangolin is still stuck in the middle of the road. Something's wrong with it, Ranger Rocky. It turned into a ball. Don't worry, Junior Rangers. That's the pangolin's way of protecting itself. When Sunda pangolins feel threatened, they curl up into a tight ball to cover vulnerable parts like their face and belly. The scales act as a piece of armor and protects them from being eaten by predators. Their scales are so tough, even tigers can't bite through them. But are pangolin scales tough enough to protect it from being run over by a car? Definitely not. However, you need to find a solution that doesn't put you in danger. I know what to do, Ranger Rocky. We can use the jetpack. I'll use my tablet to control the jetpack from here. 
We won't have to go out onto the road at all. Excellent idea, Katie. Okay, Katie, let's do this. And activate. Watch out for that car. Another one's coming your way. Almost got you, Pangolin. <gasps> car! I see it. Gotcha, Pangolin. Whoa! Don't let it fall. Phew. That was close. It's okay, Pangolin. You're safe now. What's that smell? Ugh. Yuck! It's so bad! That's coming from the pangolin. Pangolins produce a foul smell as a form of defense. The pangolin must still be afraid. What else can we do to make it feel safe again? Let's ask my friend, Ranger Kalai from Acres. He's an expert at wildlife rescue. Hello, Ranger Kalai. Hi, Ranger Rocky. Hi, Junior Rangers. Ranger Kalai. We just rescued a Sunda pangolin from a busy road. It's not injured, but it's still curled up in a ball. What should we do now? The reason why the pangolin curled up into a ball is because it's stressed and it's scared. So actually, if you leave it alone, uh, it will uncoil itself and just be on its way. And remember, one of the biggest threats to the survival of pangolins are humans. So keep the whereabouts and the location of where you have seen the pangolin to yourself. Don't share photos of it and don't tell anyone where you found it. And if you ever see a Sunda pangolin and you, and you feel that you know he's in an unsafe place, call Acres or call MPAX for further advice. There was one time where a member of public called Acres to assist to rescue a Sunda pangolin that had entered the undercarriage of a vehicle. Um, that was actually a very exhilarating experience for us because we had to go under the car, jack up the car, and slowly retrieve the pangolin from the engine bay of the vehicle. The whole rescue operation took close to about one and a half hours as we had to squeeze and slowly remove the pangolin that was gripping very firmly onto the various components of the undercarriage. So that was a, a very successful operation. Um, we are very thankful for the incident where the member of public was alert enough to see that the pangolin had entered the vehicle. If he had not, um, the driver of the vehicle might have uh, driven off with the pangolin in the undercarriage. So, luckily the pangolin survived. That was an awesome rescue! Thank you, Ranger Kalai! You're welcome! Ranger out! Ranger out! Now, let's give the pangolin some space. Look! The pangolin is uncurling! Goodbye, pangolin! Stay safe! Don't cross any more roads! That was an intense rescue, but I'm glad we got the pangolin to the other side of the road safely. Hero wants to play fetch again. Okay, Hero, see if you can catch this. Wow, good boy. Awesome catch, Hero. Good job, children. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Hi, Junior Rangers. You may not see wild animals in your everyday life, but if you ever happen to encounter them, remember these A, B, C's. A. Avoid contact with the animal. B. Be calm. C. Call the authorities. Reach out to these agencies for assistance. Here are their numbers. Support Singapore's wildlife agencies by donating to their causes or becoming a volunteer. Check out these links. Ranger out.